Okay. We had a problem uh, with our, uh, our our current. We got machines from the workshop. We broke up our workshop and we brought them home. Unfortunately, at home we only got single phase, 220 volts, and our machines are three phase, 380 volts. And we had to make a plan to to run our machines here at home. It's too costly to to uh, lay cables and so on for 380 volts. It cost us a lot of money, and uh, we decided not to do it. And then we decided to run our machine off 220 volts without changing the 380 volt motor. We kept the 380 volt motor on, and we've made ourselves a a unit to make our own three phase it's not three phase 380 volts it's three phase 220 volts so we still have our three phases and we uh, now run our uh, milli machine and all the machines that are three phase of this unit it's a little bit of a, a quick model we haven't we haven't had a chance to to better it yet but we're going to do that and uh, I'll just show you how it runs okay switch on we have two motors here one motor to start the one motor then we switch over from that motor to power we have a switch here now we try, uh, Plug out the 220 volt motor and now your 380 volt motor is running off single phase. But then it gives us three phases. We go to our machine and we start our machine and our machine runs now. Okay, stop it. Okay. You can see the machine is running. That is the feed on the bed. And there's the, uh, the tool running over there. You can see it's a little bit fast for the camera. I'm going to switch it off and switch it on again. You'll see it stop. And then we'll switch on and you can see it's starting again. So you see this machine is running off single phase. They say you can't do it. But I've proved them wrong. You can do it. No hoax. And there's no hoax here. I'm using this thing. I'm skimming cylinder heads with it. And uh, I have no loss of power. I have full power on this machine all the time. Running it on 220 volts single phase. Thank you. Thank you all.